and that piece I cut I'm gonna slide right in there to match that other piece on the other side to make that'll be my drawer guide I say I haven't got it measured out yet to get my same uh, distance sticking out just a little bit there it still may not be in, in enough see if I can move my camera a little better where you can see more here This is an old tri square I got. I can do it, lock it down for my distance, my thickness here. And I can bring it over here and get the same measurement. Man, that's perfect. And I get a measurement across that away. Take measurement to work here. Measure 16 and looks like 5 8. Let me go across the top. 16 and 5 8. Let's go across that way. Man, that looks nice. One more measurement there. 16 and 5 8. Before I do anything else, let's see how close to square these things are here. Man, that's pretty close. That is very close. That is perfect. You can't beat that with a stick. We'll make a little mark right there. And I've got a mark right there. <laughs> Probably what I'm going to do is come in here. This other one has got, uh, you can see them or not all that well. I get out of the way. They've got little angle brackets made and glued in there. I think I'm going to cut those on the other side to match. I've got one that's there that's broke. Right there, I'm going to replace it and make it match on the other side. That way they'll at least look like they're the same. And what I'll do uh, before I attach all this, I'll uh, come back and stain all that to make it. I'm going to do all that. I hadn't got any of it glued yet. And I may need to redo that one. That one's loose. Probably will. Broke too. Move my camera out of my way here. I can't see.
Get a little height there. Come back here with some small angle pieces to match the other side. That way it'll at least look like it's uh, supposed to be there. Those hang over a little bit, but I'm making them to match my other side. They hang over a little, so they at least look like they're all the same. That'll work. Yeah, I got all of them put in. Pretty much like the original was. Reuse the original one there. I think it'd be good, but man, those things are good, good and tight. Like I say, time I get that stained, I think will be be good. I can stain that. Those I'm gonna take back apart, stain them, and then uh, put them back together. Glue them up when I do. Like I say, they haven't been glued yet. <laughs> Man, that look good. Yeah, let me get a dip now. Got that will let my outside slide on my my rail, let my drawer open and close, and then I've got a groove here for the bottom of my drawer. That'll work out right. Now I need to do the same thing to this one. Just got to make sure I do it on the right side and in the right spot. So I'm going to have this one for my right hand drawer. I'm going to go ahead and mark it. My 
right drawer. And I've got that one on that side. Like that, I want that groove. Be right in there. But I want it on the inside. Be right there. Be right there on the inside. And that's the way I've got it marked on the inside. Mm. So, I want to come in here. Two and an eight. That's what I measured the other one. the groove for the inside of my drawer face mm. well find my clamp here And that's the inside of my drawer face to my uh, bottom. Like I say, my drawer front is just about a eighth of an inch, maybe three and three sixteenths. You can see wider than my sides, top and bottom. And what that's going to do when I put my front on. <clears throat> That'll let those two line up. And you can see this piece is wider than my side, top and bottom. But my groove in the bottom here lines up. Man, that's exactly what I want. That way, when this goes on that, which what I'll do, I'm going to have to put another groove in here on my drawer face but the inside to accept that and like I say that's why I made this three quarters of an inch wider that'll let that overhang just a little bit and I still have a groove in it and them pieces set up good boy what we got <coughs> man that is gonna be sweet look at that Got it upside down. But, uh, but it won't be that tight. Like I say, this piece will be this drawer front on it and all that'll line up. I think it'll work. I think it'll work good. I got my groove for the side. Then my inside part. From my bottom, like I say, that'll slide right in there and work just like that. 
That'll clear my little bracket back there. Sticks out and runs on that little rail. That'll work. Of course, it won't be that 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 tight. I'll have just a little a little groove in the side right there, so it won't be too snug. I think we can make that work, myself. <laughs> 